This is James Elder, the Castell the Show here on Box Nation. With me, I'm joined by British champion Jazza Dickens. How are we doing, Jazz? Good evening, What does it feel like to be British champion, mate? It's great. Um, it's nice of well, uh, my first man's defence. defence. Fucking hell. <laughs> 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 I've got my first man's defence defence um, in a few months for the every single one of their first bid, so yeah. I'm just waiting for the date now. Indeed, I saw Manager Shanja Martin Wald. As you said, the first bid's gone underway. Good opponent, Martin Wald. We've seen him mix at, at world level. He challenged Stewie Hall for the world title. Unfortunate with the head clashes and that, but what, what, what do you make of Martin Wald as an opponent? Yeah, I respect him. I do, I do respect him. Fight him, turn around to him, sparring, fought for the world title. So, you know, he's got a good TV and I'm happy to defend my title. We're at the MGM in Marbella. It's there for their show. Um, Lights out at the plaza, headlined by Matthew Macklin. Yep. You was probably one of the first boxers and first teams to, to come out and utilise the facilities here at the MGM. How, how do you think it's changed in that process from from maybe, I don't know, two years ago to now? There's a... Um, the same people, all the same people here, so you can tell at the ground and people around here, but um, there's a lot of new faces also. You seem like they've grown as a team. Mm -hmm. I mean, I know how much it meant to you to win that British title. What what does it mean? What will Martin Ward have to do to, to get that belt off you? Yeah, he will have to kill me. He will have to kill me. And I respect Martin for taking the fight as well, because it's been quiet. Uh, I thought I'd be a walking target once I got the British title. That's the story you hear. He wants to crack at you, but it hasn't been quiet, so... Yeah. That he stepped forward and he wants to fight. He's, he's a, you know, he's a man. He wants to fight. So, thank him for taking the fight and giving me opportunities as well on the big stage. Since you've become British champion, what what's the support levels been like from maybe your home city? What have you noticed from the home city and the people around you? To be honest, it's just the same. Um, I don't. Um, I, I mix it on my people if that makes sense, and my people are the same with me as they always have been from day one. And mm. I appreciate the support of them people from mm. from the start and. Me. For the people that don't know, or maybe not got to know you that well, religion's a big, big part of your life. The last time we spoke, we spoke quite a lot about that. Still as affluent as ever on the religion side? Yeah, of course, of course. Yeah, yeah. You have your ups and downs, like, like everything in life, like boxing. Um, everything has ups and downs on it. So sometimes I'm in church, you know, twice a day. Sometimes I'm not. Mm. But I, I've got my faith. Um, I always trust God to, to you know, give me a plan every single day. One thing about you, Jazzy, you're probably one of the, the most dedicated boxers that I know. You've never touched a drop of alcohol, never touched a cigarette, and you live in the gym. So surely opportunity is going to arise for yourself real yeah. soon. Yeah, um, I think I was known to like my cakes. That was my only downfall, downfall <laughs> um, a few, few years ago, but I've matured a lot since then. And I'm just enjoying it. I am, I'm living a clean lifestyle and I'm waiting for me opportunities. What are your targets for the new season, Jazzy? What are your plans, mate? New seasons. Um, uh, I think it's going to be a big season for me. Uh, maybe defend this British outright or um, fight for the European as a mandatory for that. And always looking towards a world title. Mm. Always. Mm. So hopefully, on Box Nation, we get to document as we have the continued rise of Jazza Dickens. I said you're really putting yourself on the map, and yeah. hopefully, this season will be another good progressive year for yourself. Yeah, of course. Um, also, with the continued support of Box Nation, you, you help me and a lot of other fighters get ourselves out there. And, yeah, I'm grateful for the support. It's a real pleasure, mate, and um, just leave my money on the side. <laughs> Great I appreciate it, lad. Nice one. Catch you again real soon. Ta -ra.